Hey, all right, welcome back. So now we're going to put a symbol onto our ring. So for those of you who are feeling and that in the need to have something uh, sweet and nice, I'm going to show you how to put a heart into this ring. Okay. So we're going to go over to Shape Generators, and we're going to go under Community tab, and we're going to pull in the heart. And this one is pretty good size already, so what I'm going to do is rotate it 90 degrees, and I'm going to shrink it down a little bit. select the corner point, hold the shift button on your keyboard, left mouse click and let's just center it, see looks about right okay and so we can make sure that it's centered can use again our align tool under adjust. So I want it lined up here and I want it lined here. There. It's right in the middle. Okay. I'll probably make that a little bigger. So let's just pull it out just a little bit. To there we go, about 6.22 millimeters by 8.881. And again, we'll just do an align. Okay. Now I'm going to move this in so it goes all the way through so we're gonna make it make a cutout I'm gonna duplicate that edit duplicate I'm gonna move it all the way across okay now I want to do the same for both sides, but I want to make sure it's aligned. So I'll show you a little trick. I'm going to select both. I'm going to group them. I'm going to duplicate them. And then I'm going to rotate them 90 degrees. And Then I'm going to use the align tool. Select them, all of them. Go to adjust, align. So, got that. Okay. So now we have our cutouts to create our, our ring, our heart ring. But before we do that, I'm going to make a copy because I'm going to show you how to make an, another design. So I'm going to duplicate it. I'm going to move that out of the way. So let's make our ring. So I'm going to turn those into holes. And I'm going to shift select the ring and group. So I'm 
I'm going to do the same thing on the other side. I'm going to select the hearts, turn those to holes, shift select the ring, and group. And there we go. We have a ring. Seems pretty thick. I think we can make that thinner. So I'm going to go back, I'm going to ungroup, and I'm going to ungroup again, select the ring, and I'm going to move these back in. I'm going to use the snap tool there though. Okay, just try to line it back up. And then we're going to select and group and do the same here and group. And there we go, we have a little heart ring to give to your girlfriend. So in the next uh, video, I'm going to show you how to make another ring with a different design. Thanks for watching. And if you like what you see and you want to see more, don't forget to subscribe.